In today's ever-evolving world, advancements are being taken in the technological industry. Unfortunately, it seems as though the energy industry is lagging behind. Many non-renewable methods are still being used across the globe, severely harming the environment. If this trend continues, we may kill off most species across the globe. Some countries, however, are combating this by instituting laws to improve the energy sector. A comparison of advancements in solar energy between the United States and Germany reveals Germany has taken steps such as the implementation of solar panels, the use of photo photovoltaic cells, and the climate action plan to become a global leader in usage of solar power. Solar power is a highly competitive energy source coming to mainstream, starting to be used much more and phase out non-renewable energy. Solar energy is harvested based on the photoelectric effect. The solar cell has two sides. One side is filled with silicon that has an extra electron, while the other side is lacking an electron. This creates a gradient. When the photon of the right energy knocks out an electron on the dope side, that electron flows to the junction in between the two sides and is captured. The free electron then goes through a circuit. Three main architectures of solar cells exist, monocrystalline, polycrystalline, and thin film. Monocrystalline is more space efficient and energy efficient than polycrystalline, however they are more expensive than polycrystalline. Polycrystalline is cheaper and easier to manufacture than monocrystalline, but less efficient. Thin film are much easier to manufacture and are more efficient, however they are very space inefficient. Thin film is also flexible and can be used to conform to other shapes, for example buildings and clothing. One company in particular, PVCOM B, focuses on the advancement of thin film photovoltaic cells by providing forefront development and technology research. PVCOM B operates complete research and design reference lines for 30 by 30 centimeter squared solar modules based on thin film silicon and CIGS as well as a 5 and 6 inch silicon heterojunction cells. The solar cells are all connected in series so that the voltages stack on top of each other with each cell providing about a 0.7 voltage drop when measured. However, when enough are connected in series, it will reach the kilovolts. Currently, solar panel efficiency is around 26%, but PVCOM B explained during a tour that they have reached the theoretical goal of 30%. They believe it cannot be progressed any farther with that type of solar panel. They began more research on silicon heterojunction cells to see if they could maximize there as well. This is just one company helping to further the solar industry. From my observations in Germany the past few weeks, many residents appear to be adding solar panels to their homes as seen in the following images. This is likely because of the cost-effective benefits surrounding it. Unlike most non-renewable methods, it does not require much material or time once constructed. It also does not heavily pollute the atmosphere. This also means once the panel is built, the maintenance cost will be low because it does not require much oversight. Because of the economical and environmental advantages, many residents and business owners alike are pushing forward towards a cleaner environment. From a recent statistic by cleanenergywire.org, solar energy lies second in current energy production with wind onshore falling at number one. This can be credited to major improvements in renewable energy across the globe. On the other hand, it appears that less people have solar panels in Louisiana. From my observations at home, it is a rare sight in the more rural areas of Louisiana. I notice more solar panels in the more developed parts of the western United States, likely as a result of environmental legislation. It is harder for the United States to improve at the rate Germany is moving because of its large population. Based on a study from CNBC, 0.4% of the United States energy comes from solar energy. However, it does appear to be on the rise. In the year 2014, the amount of electricity generated by U.S. utility-scale solar photovoltaic power plants is up more than 100% in 2014 over the same period in 2013. Even with the improvements in the energy sector, the United States still lags behind Germany. In a BAPC article published in 2018, they discussed that the Trump administration helped cut environmental regulations on carbon emissions and denied the effects of a climate change in, in an interview. This completely undermines the push towards cleaner energy. The United States does not have enough regulation on in the industry, thus causing the slower growth in the solar energy sector. Germany is a leader in efforts to go green worldwide. Germany has set a plan in place called the Climate Action Plan 2050. 
The purpose of the plan is to eliminate nuclear energy from Germany by 2022 and generate 80% of its energy from renewable resources by 2050 to create a carbon neutral environment. The Reichstag has already taken steps to achieve this goal. The Reichstag is the only government building in Berlin that runs only on renewable power. On the roof of the Reichstag, there are 3,229 square feet of solar panels that help serve as an environmentally friendly source of energy. The building also has a sun shield that tracks the movement of the sun in order to prevent direct sunlight that may contribute to unwanted heat. Meanwhile, the United States has not had much success in their efforts towards the usage of renewable energy due mostly to its large population and regressive efforts to help the non-renewable industries. As a whole, Germany has been taking the necessary steps needed to use more renewable energy sources, with improvements in solar energy being a large area of research. Germany's government provides government funding for the research of photovoltaic cells that will create more efficient solar energy. Solar panels in the United States are less common, whereas in Germany, solar panels are seen throughout.